Hi everyone, I wanted to do another product review for you today. This is the Eddie Bauer Stowaway 20 liter packable day pack backpack. And I got it this week from Eddie Bauer on sale. It was $19 Canadian. The original price on the product was $38 Canadian. And this bag is great for somebody who is going to be traveling with larger, larger luggage, um, specifically, especially if you're taking larger backpacks. But you want to have something once you reach your destination for going on day trips or hiking. It's also great if you have a large backpack, like a um, large carry-on size backpack that you're going to be stowing away in the overhead compartment and you want to have a smaller backpack that you can put under the seat in front of you with just the essentials that you need for during a flight but you don't want to have to carry two backpacks with you through the airport so that's what this is great for and that's why i bought it and just to show you it's not the smallest stowaway backpack so this one is about i would say it's about six inches tall by maybe seven or eight inches wide. Um, it can be compressed more, there's some air in here, but one of the reasons that it's a bit bigger is because it is made of a bit more durable material, I think, more thick material than some of the other packable bags. So if that's something you're interested, in, then I'll just show you what it looks like inside. And just to let you know, if this color doesn't speak to you, it does come in other colors. Um, it also comes in like a solid black, if you're interested in that but I wanted to do something a little bit more fun and comfy. So I'll just show you this backpack. Um, the pouch is one of the pockets of the backpack. So it just, when you want to unfold it, it just goes right inside and you can close that pocket now. Um, so this basically has three compartments. There's the front section, which is relatively roomy for a front section. Uh, basically the whole uh, footprint that you can see there. And then the top section, which was the pouch that it came out of. Uh, so you can pack anything that you want in there that would fit. So you could do uh, wallet, keys, um, camera, chargers, anything would go in these two pockets. And then the main section is one big section with either a laptop or a tablet or a notebook uh, compartment at the back that has a little piece of micro there. So you don't want to put anything bigger than a 13 inch laptop in here. It's not going to fit. Uh, just to bear in mind, there's no real padding here. So if you have a really thin case for a 13 inch laptop, it will fit, but it will be snug. Um, anything bigger than that is not going to fit in that pocket, just so you know. Um, it is some people like to put something more uh, flat and rigid at the back just for when you're wearing it to make it more comfortable. So you could do a notebook or a clipboard would work as well. And then the main section is big enough uh, that you could put a jacket, a pair of shoes, some food, uh, or if you're traveling with kids, you could certainly put diapers and change of clothes for the kids in here. So it's a pretty good size bag. It also has two water bottle or pockets on the sides that you could put water bottle, umbrella, anything you want that would fit in there. And uh, you also have these attachment points if you wanted to attach anything, for example, with a carabiner, that would work. And just to show you what it looks like on. Uh, so the straps are fairly flimsy, but they're also pretty comfortable. They don't come with any chest straps or waist straps. Um, but this is how the bag looks on me. I am very small, so just to let you know, this bag may look big on me, but it's actually not very big. Um, and it's very comfortable, so I think that this will do a good job of doing what I need as a day pack when I arrive at my destination. And it's small enough to be packed in my bigger luggage. So thanks for watching. I hope that you found this helpful.